Raw Bush here, uh, kicking back reading my uh, Tom Bearden free, free Energy Generation book. Uh, I got this last weekend in the mail, and uh, the main reason why I bought this is there was a reprint of uh, John Bendini's Free Energy Generator and some instructions on how to build it. Kind of vague, but uh, enough to give you an idea. You got a 12 volt motor, some mass and an energizer or alternator. Mainly the difference here is all these magnets out face north. Coils are ran in parallel, blah, blah, blah. And then there's a commutator that switches in between this stuff. And there's a little deep, brief description so forth. Um, I've got the motor, the mass, and I just kind of finished the commutator and that's kind of where I wanted to show you. So this is what we've got so far. Got a 12 volt motor I found lying around. Uh, it pulls 13 amps is what it says on there. I think 1100 RPM. Cruises to my mass, which is uh, it was another DC motor that was around. Um, hollowed it out other than the magnets on the outside. Some big old heavy duty bad boys. So they're there to provide the weight. And then I've got the commutator section. Now the idea is to turn the motor on for a minute, for a brief second, and then send a charge at the same time back to the battery. Essentially the battery should never know that it ever powered the motor and therefore should run forever. That's the idea. So the commutator, which was kind of my tough spot because I wasn't exactly sure how to do it. And in the book there are instructions to do it with solid state, but you almost need a scope to uh, be able to watch it to set it up accordingly so this mechanical should uh, hopefully make it a little easier on me what we got is a set of brushes out of a fan or a drill I think and what's tip you know what's typical is right in there those little holes that's typically where the winding ties into and gets contacted by the brushes. We want it to be on a little less than 180 degrees. And by the instructions, what I figured out is that if I tie, you can start to see now that this one here in the middle of the screen has a piece of wire on it and it's soldered to the next one. So this one at top is off. One two, three, and four are on. And then it goes back to off. Those four tie in to a piece of copper uh, tubing that now runs on another brush. So the idea is the power comes in there, goes across only to those four brushes. When it makes contact with one brush, one brush on the side here, it sends power to the motor, which turns the motor on, makes it run around. And as soon as it passes, it'll now, once I have the energizer, once I make that, at that point, it starts to send energizer juice back to the battery during that off time. So, I've got that part so far good. Um, it, does, it does run, we'll do that for you. The next part, like I said, is the energizer, and that would be at the end of the shaft. All this is built onto a little speaker box that I had laying around. We'll turn that off. Did that help any? So here's the end and the shaft. And one of the things I found in a motor that I took apart trying to find some brushes is this coil. And what I want to try is to utilize this. It's actually, all the coils have a bi filler, and some of them actually have the tri. So I'm going to use the bi, the two coils on the bi filler, and make a magnetic rotor. And uh, hopefully, this will generate what I need, the right signal. It kind of explains in the book the signal I'm looking for. But in the end, should look something like that and we'll see if we can get it running but uh, let me show you uh, turn it on and let it run basically um, it's not got any input from the other side so it won't uh, energize itself 
key here is to make sure this is not in the motor on position. You gotta kinda pull start it. So we get that in the off position. We're on the battery charger. And we'll give her a slight spin. All a little sparky, I guess, huh? brush for the motor going to the motor, but other than that, everything else seems to be running rather smoothly. Well, off to build the uh, Energizer. Draw bush. We'll talk to you guys later.